So yes, we're finally got to Australia. I'm a big Pop Mart fan. Pop Mart has a lot of cute figures that I like to collect. Peach Riot was the latest victim of my collecting habits. But with Peach Riot, I was able to like control myself and only buy like five figures. Let me count. Five figures. I wanted to get the whole box, but it was like a million dollars. The workers there were really like trying to convince me to buy a big box. I don't know if Pop Mart workers get commission. Um, I don't know. If you work at Pop Mart, let me know because that would make a lot more sense as to why they're always trying to upsell stuff. But never have I bought a whole box because I had self control. Had. And then this little lady came out, Nyota. I was on Pop Mart's Instagram a few months ago. They announced a new character and it was Nyota. Obviously, it was US. And being an Australian, anything in the US isn't gonna come to Australia for 10 years. I got an email like last week and it was like, an item that you are after is in stock. I didn't want to buy online. Okay, okay, that's a lie, that's a lie. I was gonna buy it online. I kept adding it to my card and taking it out because I, I saw the amount and I was like, no, 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 I don't need it. I don't need it, like it's expensive. I was at the shops and I walked into a Pop Mart store and I saw a Nyota there and I got it. It was like $260 or something like that. Just just look how cute it is, okay? Look how cute it is. Like, I can justify this. She's like, I'll just unbox this on TikTok. But then I realized that I will want to yap about it. This is a good opportunity to finally start the YouTube account I've been talking about since I was like six. I started a YouTube when I was younger and it was like a singing account. But it wasn't a singing account. Like, this is a secret, okay? But now it's a secret for the whole internet to know. At the camera. Like down here, like from a lower angle. My grade 5 is self, like singing Hallelujah by Leonard Cohen. I think it got like 12 views. And then like the other video I posted on that account was like when Minecraft had just released cats, like ocelots. And I got my iPad and I was like filming the TV on my iPad. So back then I didn't know what editing was. It was just me trying to tame an ocelot and failing for like a good 10 minutes. Um, so that's kind of embarrassing, but I deleted those videos once I was in high school. Anyway, let's do an unboxing. Nyota, Nyota's fluffy life. So here are all the options. Um, ignore my camera skills. <laughs> They're all so cute. I really want the cat ones though. Luckily, I'm a scrapbooker. This box is so cute. Probably should have got some scissors. I had really long nails a couple days ago, but like whenever I think too hard or like daydream, I've noticed myself like picking in my nails and I rip them all off. So I can't use them to open the box. But... Oh my god. Oh my god. How do I do this thing? Got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it. I don't think I'm gonna rip off. I don't think I'm gonna rip off like the front little thing. But... Few minutes later. It looks cuter. It doesn't appear like this. As I said earlier, like I would be happy to get any of the cats. I actually don't want the secret. I don't want it because obviously to get the secret means that you like lose one of the other ones. And if I lose one with a cat, I'll actually cry. The box is so cute. Like, oh my god. Oh. So the first box is our secret. I love the little cat's head is in the bag and like how she's kind of leaning over to it. This is a really strong start, okay? We got a cat. We got one of the five cats. Oh, this one's heavy. This one's heavier than the last one. The one of my friends the other day got a blind box me when I got this box. And instead of ripping the tab, she just like started opening it. It was so unsatisfying. I was like, don't do that, man. Okay. I forgot it was here. So if you open this, there's like a little tab here. You can just pull back to open it so much easier. The second box is a brief escape. This one's really cute, but I'm also kind of scared of it. Like, is that just me? I do like the artsy vibes though. Another cat one! Brave together. Let's be real, this one is the cutest one so far. I love how she's kind of hiding in her jumper and the cat has turned into like a ghost or whatever and she's on her little tippy toes. Oh my god! This one's light off. These are so hard, like these actually all feel the same. Like usually with blind boxes you can shake them and like based on the movement you can kind of tell like what's in there. These ones all feel the same, so if you're not buying a full box and you want something specific, good luck with that. We got calling, which is so cute. 
I love the color scheme in this one, the pink and the yellow and blue. Her pose is cute too and the idea of it, but why does she look kind of scared? Her sleeve is giving Ariana Grande. Okay, really, Anyways. Okay, okay, this one's the cutest so far. We got Days. This is literally me with my cats. I just lay on them and they tolerate it. Her little outfit's so cute. I love the back. This is Meow. Oh my god. It's giving Lexapro zombies. I haven't gotten the big cat yet, so we are halfway now. This is the sixth box. This one is Sea Love, which is like the most normal one from the whole set. It's just Nyota doing a silly little pose in a silly little outfit. It is really cute, but is it just Nyota did her hair change color? Anyway, let's keep unboxing these. Anyway, make enthusiasm. We got Little Mountain, which I think is arguably the most popular from the set. I've seen so many people post her, but I mean, for good reason. Look how cute she is. She's so silly. She kind of reminds me of my friend who does Pilates in that weird pose. Five boxes left. We've been through more than half. That's a stupid name. I guess that's why I'm not in charge of naming them. Oh my gosh, look, it's magnetic. So even if I put it on like this. Oh my God, love that. So this one is Unknown Road. I love how she's holding a little silly hat. Um, and her little jumpsuit thing. Um, so mysterious. It's on the side of the box, y'all. Yeah. Yay! Okay, let's open this one. Ah. Why is this one opening fine? This one's opening bad. What the balls? What the heck? So this one is Lost Star, which I was anticipating so much. It's so tiny and it just goes in her little hands. I'm definitely gonna lose that. Um, I was kind of disappointed though that her star didn't rest in her hands. I had to kind of jam it between her mouth and her hands. Still so cute though, to be fair. That's our last three boxes. Okay, these boxes are getting harder and harder to open. I don't know if I'm just getting weaker or what, man. I don't know, look how unsatisfying that rib was. So we got Warm Sunlight, another cat one. I'm so satisfied by this and just the simplicity of it. It's so mundane that it makes me feel happy. I look at it and I'm like, oh my god, I love this. My cat just saw a bird and it's chirping at it. I just really want the cat. Come on. Yes. So I finally got Kitten Hug. This one is the one that I wanted most. It's literally on the front of the box, okay? It's on the front of the big box, on the front of the little box. It's on front of all the boxes. So if I didn't get it, I was gonna buy it a little bit. But I got it and um, yeah, life is set now. This figure is everything I ever wanted and needed. I love how they're both giving side eye and how the cat is giant. Like I wish I could experience this. It's just so cute. My last box is either gonna be home or the secret um at this point now that i've gotten all the cat ones i am happy with either of those options is it the secret is it the home one so the final box is home and it's kind of giving me like female hirono vibes it's just i don't know it's just the vibes i don't know how to explain it uh, trash everywhere so let's talk about my favorite three if you know me you know that i'm a very predictable person um i love cats so obviously my top three are all the ones that have cats, but which ones? So, number three, Days. Days really stood out to me because out of the whole set, I feel like it had the most unique pose, especially one that has a cat in it as well. Like I feel like the others had unique props, but this one is just the pose. My second place, obviously is another cat one, um, and that one goes to Warm Sunlight. I feel like I like warm sunlight because I just relate to it so much. That is literally how I hold my cats and we're just, we're just vibing, you know? I like that she's on the grass as well. It feels like she's outside with her cat. First place goes to... Kitten Hog! Nobody is surprised that this is my number one. It's literally the one on the front of all the boxes. So Pop Art knew what they were doing, marketing this specific figure to people like me. It's just so cute and dreamy. I love the design. So here is the full collection, the full set. They are all so cute. I have no regrets at all. 
um, my wallet does so. though. If you're into blind boxes, like there's like one design you really don't want. You're like, out of all of them, I don't want this one. Like it's so ugly. Like there's always just that one. But with this set, like I was so happy to buy the whole set because I love all of them. Yeah, that was not a bad one out of the set. I'm glad that I got all the cat ones instead. Um, speaking of cats, my cat is meowing in my door right now. Yeah. But yeah, so I'm so glad that I bought that whole box. Um, thank you so much for watching my yapping, my rambling. This page is probably going to be like dedicated to unboxings, vlogs, just silly stuff like that, yapping, my favorite thing to do. But yeah, thank you so much for watching.